In this lesson tutorial, we're going to cover the progressions used in the song My God is Awesome by Charles Jenkins. And this song is in the key of E major. And in order to proceed with this lesson, you're going to need to be familiar and already know category 1 and category 3 diatonic chords in the key of E major. If you haven't learned those yet, then uh, you can pause this video now and go back to the Musician's Toolbox and download category 1 and 3 and learn those chords first because we're going to need those chords. Uh, to play uh, the progressions in this tutorial. You're going to also need the dominant 11 chord uh, tutorial which is in the uh, Musician's Toolbox also because we're going to need a 511 chord uh, from that family of course also. So let's get started. Let's take a look at the E major scale. E is 1, F sharp is 2, G sharp is 3. So here's my 511 chord and we're just going straight off the numbers. 5 remember will always take us to a 1 chord, a 511 will. So we start off with a 511. My God is awesome. And that's just because it's to our five chord, and I'm using category three. Keep me in the valley. That's my sixth chord. Hide me from the rain. Okay, now we're, we're on the four chord here. So let me do this one, five, six, four. So if you're playing that one, five, six, four chord progression and you, and you begin to think that, wow, that sounds like something I might have already heard. That means that your ear is recognizing that chord progression because hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of songs that are written today and produced and ones that will be written in the future are using that progression. So this is one of those key progressions that you want to take and learn it in all the diatonic keys because it will come up again. And the more prepared we are, uh, the better we are, more ready to learn a song on the fly. When somebody shoves a CD at us and we only got two or three minutes, we can listen to that because we're trying to learn progressions that we need to know in order to be effective by playing by ear. So here's what I get. And we have worksheets and charts for all our video lesson tutorials with full transcriptions of the lesson content that can be downloaded and printed, standard notation for the reader, and keyboard hand position images for the non-reader. Great for practice and on the gig. So enhance your piano by ear experience and download your charts and worksheets today.